Hi friends, and welcome back to The Refrigerator. I have a very special project for us to do today and a very special story. But first, I want you to go grab someone in your house who you love and respect. You can grab someone or more than one person, your mom, your dad, whoever. Go grab them and have them join us today. All right, today's story is called I Am Enough, and it is written by Grace Byers. Like the sun, I'm here to shine. Like the voice, I'm here to sing. Like the bird, I'm here to fly and soar high over everything. Like the trees, I'm here to grow. Like the mountains, here to stand. Like time, I'm here to be and be everything I can. Like the champ, I'm here to fight. Like the heart, I'm here to love. Like a ladder, here to climb. And like the air, to rise above. Like the wind, I'm here to push. Like a rope, I'm here to pull. Like the rain, I'm here to pour and drip and fall until I'm full. Like the moon, I'm here to dream. Like the student, here to learn. Like the water, here to swell. Like the fire, here to burn. Like the winner, I'm here to win. And if I don't, get up again. I know that I may sometimes cry, but even then, I'm here to try. I'm not meant to be like you. You're not meant to be like me. Sometimes we will get along, and sometimes we will disagree. I know that we don't look the same. Our skin, our eyes, our hair, our frame. But that does not dictate our worth. We both have places here on earth. And in the end, we are right here to live a life of love, not fear. And to help each other when it's tough, to say together, I am enough. You guys are all enough. Today we are going to draw self-portraits. Go ahead and get a pencil and get ready to draw. Alright my friends, I hope you have out your pencil. So we are going to make self-portraits and that means we're going to draw a picture of yourself. Together we are going to draw a head and then I'm going to add some details to my picture to make it look like me and you can go ahead and do the same to make it look like you uh, when we get to that point. But first, let's draw a head and two eyes and a nose and a mouth, and then we'll get to those details, all right? For our head, we are going to draw a, an oval shape because heads are not perfectly round circles. And I'm going to make my self-portrait a little bit cartoony, but you can make yours more realistic if you feel like it. For my eyes, I'm going to draw two big circles and then I'm going to draw two little circles in those big circles. Then I'm going to give myself a nose. And I'm going to give myself a smile. To draw my smile, I'm going to draw a straight line and then a U connecting that line. Just like that. All right. 
Now I'm going to add the details to my face. And the way I'm going to do that is I'm going to add some hair and my glasses. I'm gonna give myself a bang trim, something I can't do right now in real life, but in my picture, I'm definitely gonna do that. Can't wait to see what makes you special. Alright, now I'm going to trace and then I'm going to add some color. Alright, now I'm going to add my color. And if you don't have the right colors of your hair or your skin, that's okay. Go crazy. Maybe you feel purple. to do is we are going to write some words on our paper that describe who we are on the inside and words that mean a lot to us. For me, for me I'm going to write things like mommy because I'm Arlo's mommy and I'm going to write artist because I like to create things and teacher because that's my favorite job in the whole wide world. On your, on your paper, you can go ahead and color or paint your background any color you want. Alright, kind of looks like I gave myself a little shirt. That's fun. I can't wait to see what your self-portraits look like. Stay tuned after this video to see some paintings and some pictures that have been sent to me. And we'll see you next time on The Refrigerator.